A Washington state senator visited Vancouver today to hear from locals about the dangers of fentanyl use in the area. It was one of six stops on Senator Maria Cantwell's state tour to hear from those on the front lines about what needs to be done. Fox 12's Carly Olson was there and brings us the details. It was here inside the Clark County Public Service Center that doctors, law enforcement officers, and fentanyl survivors themselves gathered together to share their perspectives on the fentanyl crisis. This comes after the sharp rise in fentanyl deaths in the county over the past few years. It just spiraled out of control so quickly, like, I don't even, like, weeks went by and all of a sudden my life was ruined. It was a life Niles Haas never imagined, getting addicted to fentanyl after using it to escape the pain of childhood trauma and losing everything. Getting locked up and me getting in trouble was what started things getting better for me because I realized I didn't want to do this anymore. He and fellow survivor Aaron Lopez shared their stories of recovery with Washington Senator Maria Cantwell on Monday during her Vancouver visit. I would do anything to talk to Get some more drugs. I start panhandling, and when that didn't pan out, I would start going to stores and stealing. It was a special kind of help. In Clark County, fentanyl caused deaths have increased by more than 500% in the past few years, with 11 deaths in 2018 and 67 in 2022. And the CDC has estimated that Washington experienced the largest increase in drug overdose deaths between last year and this year. These are heartbreaking stories, and we've heard them from all over our state. Cantwell said her top priority after the tour is getting the FEND Act passed through the House of Representatives. That act would help government agencies crack down on opioid supply chains and declare international fentanyl trafficking a national emergency. And the fact that people can get so easily addicted to something that is so cheap and moving through the community, that we definitely want to uh, attack how this is being distributed, but also get people help and try to prevent its usage. For more details about that discussion, you can look up the web version of this story at kptv.com. Reporting in Vancouver, Carly Olson, Fox 12 Oregon.